Hello, I'm Jody Brenner Ginsburg of Ginsburg Law Offices, and I want to talk with you today about how you handle your employer when they threaten to fire you, threaten to get interference with your case if you hire a lawyer. It is certainly your choice whether or not you choose to hire a lawyer. I can tell you I've had many, many people call me and say, Jody, I wish I had hired you three weeks ago, six months ago, one year ago, whatever the case may be, I really could have used your advice at that point in time and my employer is not looking out for me at all. In fact, what my employer has done over the last however much time it's gone since their injury is threatened to fire me, threatened to not allow me to get medical care, has talked nasty to me, has done a lot of things that I don't care for and wish that I had been able to have some answers to. Now I'm not here to tell you that every employer is going to do that. Some of them are going to handle it and do what they're supposed to do, but others not always. In situations where your employer is not cooperating, it is very important that you document what is going on. Meaning, hey, Mr. Boss or Mrs. Boss, I sustained injury on this date. I need medical care. Please send, give me the list of doctors. I sustained injury on this date. I have a doctor who's kept me out of work for the last four weeks. Have you sent this in information to the insurance company? Where are my TTD benefits? And again, you may not know all of these questions to ask or these statements to make, and that is why you do need to call a lawyer. As far as your employer is concerned, they should not be retaliating against you. If you sustained a legitimate injury on the job, you're entitled to receive medical benefits and if you are unable to work and it's be, been told, you, told to you by an authorized treating physician or they've put you on a light duty job and there is no light duty job, then you're entitled to weekly income benefits or partial benefits depending upon what's being offered to you. There are many benefits out there for you to be able to obtain when you're injured on the job. And if you are unable to get those benefits, if your boss is not cooperating, then yes, you probably do need to call a lawyer and I'm more than glad to speak with you about those issues and how we can quickly get this taken care of for you. Please give me a call at 770-351-0801 and I'll be more than glad to speak with you about this. Thank you. Hi, this is Jody, and I hope you found this video helpful. If you'd like to know more about all rights and benefits available to you under the Georgia Workers Injury Laws, I'd like to invite you to download my Georgia Workers Compensation Survival Kit that I created for folks just like you. Some of the topics I cover include, can I get fired for filing a work injury claim? Eight critical mistakes to avoid. Is it true that the insurance company will hire a private investigator to follow me around and videotape my activities? What happens when the insurance company is late with my weekly wage payments? Seven specific tactics I recommend to maximize your case settlement value. If you or a loved one needs to maximize your recovery from your Georgia workers' compensation claim, you'll find this survival kit important reading. Download your survival kit right now and at no cost. Just visit my website and sign up. It's that easy. Please act now, and as always, I wish you the best.